Hey guys, time for another farm guide. Uh, this one's going to be on tree runs, uh, morning and night tree runs. So the first place you want to go is Lumbridge. Um, this method is very expensive. It costs a little over three mil a day, but I get around 250k XP to 300k uh, XP per day. And um, what you want to do is take five magic saplings and six palm saplings. What you do is click on the mage tree. This one's not fully grown because I just messed up the video. Then you pay the farmer and the option comes up yes or no. You press yes. Then you put the magic tree in and then you pay the farmer again. Okay. So the next one is Falador. We're going to do the same method. Um, bring cash with you. That way you can... Um, you can take down the tree faster than you would normally cutting it. Um, my tree runs usually take, let's see, eight to ten minutes, depending on um, a lot of things. Just depends on if I'm doing stuff in real life or not. So, yeah. Okay, the next place is a little different. Um, you take your dueling ring, you go to Castle Wars. We're going to use the balloon, um, the hot air balloon. Um, yeah. Chop down one of these trees, should be fine. And then use the balloon to go to, um, to go to Taverly, right here. And this will bring you to your next, um, your next magic tree spot. So yeah, um, like I said earlier, my 50 mil farming is going to be later tonight during my night tree run. So that'll be at the end of the video if anyone wants to see it. Not having a party or anything, just... Yeah. Okay, the next place is Falador. Or not Falador, Varrock. And, um, yeah. You bring two Varrock tab because you go to Varrock and then it's just easier to go back to Varrock for your next tree. It's just in a, di a different direction. So, um, been rune crafting. Got 42.778 mil in room crafting. I just got rank 64 last night. And I think I'm rank 117 in farming. But um, later today, I will be rank 116 or 115. Okay, take your rock teleport. Go back to the rock. Now you're going to quickly use the bank to um, get items for your... Uh, to to be able to plant your palms. Okay, so you go in the bank and you take out um, a teleport crystal and your witch doctor mask or um, you can purchase little uh, teleports to to the place. Uh, I forgot his name. I'll put it in in, um, in the description or something. So you go to uh, Stronghold, the you gnome know Stronghold, and then you you go to the palm tree patch first. Each one of these gives um, around 10k experience, and also each one of the mage trees gives around 13k experience. So, yeah, it's pretty pretty decent, but it's expensive. But I mean, to me, it's worth it. We're going for 200 mil anyway, so. The, me, um, the palm trees take a little longer because you have to pick the fruit and then cut them down. So, um, yeah, it's just just make a note of that. There's a, a magic tree patch right here. And you just do the same thing as you did for the other magic trees. Just pay the person and then plant it and pay them again. And you're good to go. Okay, so we run back up to the big spirit tree, and then we're gonna go to um, we're gonna go to the gnome maze 
for the next tree. Mm-hmm. Uh, the, the village, actually. But it's inside the maze. So yeah, um... I was looking at the nature rune prices and I got really mad at Jagex because they're 168 now and that's like freaking retarded because I have 1.2 mil mats. So here we are at the, uh, the Gnome Village uh, Pumpkin. Alright, took a little longer than usual. Uh, the tree wasn't finished, but it usually is. Um, they take 15, 15 hours to grow. And, um, yeah, 15 hours to grow. Sometimes they, t- they get disease, so well, that's why you pay the farmer and yeah, why not. So, um, the next place we're going to go is to the herb or habitat. You use your witch doctor mask for that to teleport. Or you can purchase uh, purchase little pouch things from this guy. Where are they? Here they are. Teleport spirit bags. You can buy those. Those are um, much are they two k each. If I advise getting the um, the mask. It's on un- unlimited teleports. Junior, so it's cool. Um, yeah. So. Thirty eight mil on uh watching. That's cool. Going for fifty mil on that, fifty mil on that, fifty mil on that. This guy's a little tricky. Um what you do is you pay for the tree. It says give me fifteen mil, okay, but you have to go through all the options. So three options and you're good. Alright, next go to Yetta. Use the teleport crystal. And then go down here, it's right over here. And like I said, uh, fruit trees take a little longer because you have to pick, pick the fruit and then uh, then chop it down. For the regular trees, you don't have to chop them down, so that's pretty cool. What I'm doing here right now with the fruit is giving it to the... Um, to the guy in the green, I forget what he's called, the exchange guy, and um, he notes all the items for you. Okay, next you want to go to uh, Artie, and uh, we're actually going to Bermhaven. So we go south, south this way, and um, we take a boat. Almost done. There's a cow cow tree you do. Um, it takes 25 hours to grow, so I just do them every other day. Um, it's south of here. Um, I think I'm just gonna run to it for you. And also, there's a spirit tree um, east east of this place. So that one gives like 35 to 40 k XP every three days. So let me just show you that one, and then we'll run down to the Calcula tree. You see, this is where the spirit tree is right here, right there. Now we'll run to the Calcula. Uh, let's see, 116k till 50 mil farming. That is pretty cool. I'm getting about 7 mil XP a month, like 1.8 mil XP a week, and 250k XP a day. Just depends on the day because, like, my max in a day was like 385k or something, 
I don't remember exactly what I did, but I think it was a lot of herbs, a lot of herbs. See, um, for this you can pay the guy, or you can use super combo. Sometimes it dies. Um, this one's dead, but this is where it is. And then you take your uh, mud battle staff or earth staff, and then you teleport to Catherby if you're on Lunars. If not, then use um the Camelot teleport tab, and then you run east all the way to the beach, and that's where your last tree is, and that and that'll finish up our tree run for the the morning. So, yeah, it took about like uh, 10 minutes, 11 minutes right there. So, watch how it's going a little slow because I'm making the video. Usually it's like 8 minutes, something like that. So, yeah, that's my tree run, tree run guide. And I hope you liked it and hope this helps you. Um, you can subscribe. You can like this video. You can comment. You can do whatever. I mean, <laughs> all right. Have a good day, guys. Bye. Hey, guys. Time. For <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right. It's time for my nightly farm run. Uh, I'm gonna be getting 50 mil farming now. Woo! 37k away from it. Um, uh, my brother's in the background. Yeah. So um yeah, to do the nightly farming run, it's just it's just the um the full morning farm run minus the palm trees right there. So um I do this around what time is it? 10 p.m. right now. I do this around 10 p.m. Basically the same thing. Get uh get out your spade and dibbler. Let's see dibbler. Basically pay these people. I'm not even gonna have a party or anything. It's whatever. Um, just kind of video. Okay, so next go to Falador. 23k. Pretty cool. No, oh, my hair's all messed up from being up all day. 23k. That's cool. That's uh, tr two more trees because the 13k each. So we'll go to this. This one. Let's do this. Alright, next tree. Which will be Taverly, if you remember from my uh, morning run. Uh, go to Castle Wars. I um, actually forgot my Inferno days, so. Gotta, oh, wait, no, it's on me. I'm all out of sorts right now, whatever. So, um, chop a tree down, and then. Uh, why bastard? Tabberly. Oh, need one set of normal logs. Thing with the days is that it uh, was it like one out of four logs is burned or something or something like that. We had a chance of it going away. All right, so we're gonna get 50 mil farming right now. It's pretty cool. And there it is. Um, taking a picture. Even though there's a video. Okay, cool. Just got 50 mil farming. Um, I got rank 116 today in farming, and probably when I log out, it's gonna be 115. Cause I know someone was like 4k before 50 mil XP. So. <laughs> Almost done the farming run. Um, yeah, that's cool. Um, I got 15 mil in Haunter today. 
I was hunting Grenwalls. They're actually pretty good XP. I mean, people say they're like 80, 70, 80 K XP, but I was getting like 120 K XP um, per hour. And I was making pretty good money. It's actually a lot faster and easier and more profit if you buy the Pawa, Pawa meat and use that instead of um, doing them both together. Um, yeah, so it's more money that way. So I guess that uh, concludes my my guide. I hope you um, you enjoyed it and yeah, congrats to me on 50 mil farming. It's all right. All right, bye guys.